So I give it to the client, and he says, this looks good, I guess, but what I really want is for these to kind of angle to the point to the center. And I say, oh, that's a terrible design choice, but you're, you're the client, and I am a pushover, and that's a good example for showing you a Photoshop demonstration of the transform tool and things with layers, so okay, Sandy Dune. So I can shift select all of these layers, hit control T to transform, and move it so it goes like this. Now, what did I do right there? I held, now, I'm gonna tell you that you can hold down control and just shift it so it looks like this, but let me give you a piece of advice. Don't try memorizing what control does, just as you didn't try remembering what shift does. Remember that it's one of them, control, shift, or alt that does it. Do this the first time. Don't worry about it, hit control Z. I'm telling you, if you hold down control, you can get this happening, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna hold all of these, do the same thing for this. Control T, move this to here, have it snap into place. Do the same thing for all of this, have it snap into place. And all I'm doing is I'm selecting all of them. I am hitting Control T, I'm holding down control, and I'm moving it so it goes like this. And then I'm gonna shift select these, move them up a little bit, and I wanna actually move them to the back of the stacking order. So I'm just going to click and drag, so they're now at the back of the stacking order, and do the same thing for these. I'm just gonna move them up a little bit, there we go, and move them to the back of the stacking order. And now let's move this into the center. We'll move this right here. Give this to Sandy Dune. He looks at it and says, Ah, uh, this is all right, I guess, but what I really want, and then he gives me another command. 